tell you what this virus is doing, it's bringing out the best in people and their ability to give money to charity and all that sort of thing. And I overheard Fred, Ken and Bert talking about how they were going to give money to the church collection. And Ken says, what I do, I draw the line in front of me with chalk and I throw all my loose change in the air. And what comes down my side is mine and what goes down the other side, the good Lord can keep. And Fred says, I use a very similar method, he said. I draw a circle in front of me and I draw all my loose change in the air and what lands in the circle is mine and what lands on the outside, the good Lord can keep. And Bert said, I do a very similar thing to that myself, you know, but just slightly different. He says, I throw all my loose change in the air and what's come down is mine and what the good Lord can catch you in case. <laughs> Anyhow, this is time, you know, you start of think, thinking of VE Day coming up, don't you? And how people fought in the war. And I remember Uncle Bert, he was in the Royal Standbacks, first of all. Then he went on to serve with distinction in the second um, Devonshire Foot and Mouth. I remember once, well, several years ago, Great Aunt Mary Ann sent me a parcel for my birthday, huge parcel, I opened it up, and there was Great Uncle Bert's greatcoat in there. And there was a little letter attached to it, and I opened the letter, it said, Dear Roland, that's my name. She said, this is for you, but you'll find, with the cost of the postage and the weight of the brass, I've cut the buttons off, and I want the button on it. She said, but not to worry, she said, because you'll find them in the top left-hand pocket. <laughs> she also wrote on the PS on the letter, I was going to enclose a five-pound note, but I'd sealed the envelope. <laughs> Talking about exploits in the war, a great friend of ours who lived in the above is called Grigor Bandyshewski, and he fought in the Polish Free Air Force. And he was invited by Mr. Vaughan to give a talk to the Tuesday Club, it's RWI, about his exploits. And he stood up there and I still see him, they were all there, the ladies in the, you know, sitting watching and waiting. And he said at one stage, we were fighting in the air, and said, Fokker come out of the sky so, and another Fokker came up from below me, and another Fokker came from the right hand side. And at the end, the, the vicar was getting a little bit hot under the collar, and at the end of the talk, he said to the ladies, he said, look, I've got to tell you that when Mr. Bandyzewski mentioned the word Fokker, he was in fact talking about a type of German aeroplane. Is that not so, Mr. Banduzuki? He said, yeah, that is so, but all these fuckers was Messerschmitts. <laughs> well, there we are. That's my little tale of the war for you. Stay well. See you next week. Yeah.